Today is my first day back for classes. So right now I'm getting ready and gonna pick my outfit. It's really hot today. It's like a hundred and something. Oh, my makeup's pretty much done, but I'm gonna um, do my hair because it looks weird and kind of oily and stuff. So I need to fix it. Hey, so I am coming in for the voiceover in this video because there's lots of silent parts that I kind of just left there um, where I'm like not talking and explaining so I'm here to explain to you what's going on so right now I am really struggling to curl my hair the right way I have so many layers in my hair but I've always gotten this haircut for the past two years so I feel like I should be used to it by now but usually I let it go natural today was a special day because it was the first day of class so I was like why not but to be honest with you, I don't know what I'm doing, so this is not, yeah, I don't know. I was going to say this is not a tutorial, but obviously it's not, guys. <laughs> yeah, like, um, it's just interesting. But because I have so many layers, I just do whatever the hell with the curling iron, and it ends up looking fine because everything kind of camouflages itself, but also my hair is really dark, so... outfit it's pretty basic to be honest it's just like all black and it's a tank top like this and I wore a little necklace backpack I have my hotspot flea 100% hottie pin handmade keychain on this side which adds because I have a plaid transport backpack I only have one class today so I'm gonna try to like run some errands yeah I like also want to go get a coffee. I know I shouldn't, but my excuse is that it's the first day of school and yeah, <laughs> that's my excuse. So I'm probably going to head out right now. I need to go get gas and I'm gonna probably most likely grab a coffee because I'm being naughty. because I was on summer break for a while. My college, the way they kind of set up, it's like by semester and some colleges are by quarter, but mine's by semester, so our break is pretty long. So today, I don't know if I mentioned already, I probably did, I only have one class. Um, so I'm planning to get some supplies because I'm doing a fourth market with Hotspot Flea and I'm sure you guys have seen it a lot already on my Instagram um, but I need to get supplies for that because I just want to be prepared and I am excited and I'm gonna be bringing new stuff to my table so I am excavating some new supplies and looks and everything I want to show you guys my rings um, but someone's looking at me my rings I have this really cute black heart one from a girl that I uh, vended next to. I vended next to her like two markets ago and I bought something from her last market and her name is Rare Mythos on Instagram and she like hand solders it all and I just thought it was so cute and yeah. Guys the cutest thing just happened to me so I went to this stone place to get breakfast because I was like I haven't eaten and um, I wanted to eat before going to class. And I was really indecisive about what I wanted and the lady was so sweet and she just gave me a free scone and it's actually like really big and they heated it up. So I went to the library to do some homework before I went in because I had some homework. I have four in-person classes and one online. My online class is film animation 
and I had a, an assignment for it already so I was reviewing it looking it over and then reading the syllabus for some classes but yeah I was just like chilling in the library for a bit because it was so hot outside and yeah after that I went to class Hey y'all, so I just got back to my car. It's been a long day, but I'm finally done with classes for the day and I'm gonna head home. I have a, two assignments actually so far, but they're not crazy. They're just writing assignments, so I'm gonna do that. And I'll check in with you guys tomorrow when I have my class tomorrow. Pardon, my hair is an absolute disaster. It's an atrocity, but I just wanted to show you guys what I'm up to because I'm actually really excited about this. Good morning. It's Tuesday and I do have class today. This morning though I'm trying to get stuff done. So I'm uploading a video and I also I'm gonna make some necklaces because I have another market on the 9th, which is two weeks from now. Um yeah, I have a market two weeks from now, so I'm working on that stuff like in the mornings before class because usually after I'm tired and it's hard for me to do stuff besides homework because I already have homework, so. Um, what time is it? It's 7.30 a.m. And I woke up at 6. I am an early riser and thank God for that because I get so much work done before I have to do anything. Myself. You know, just... That is impossible. Unless you mean... I try to go out sometimes in the morning, um, and it was a really pretty morning. The light was nice. Here's my outfit for the second day of class. And yeah. each grade level and so I just finished my second day it's so hot out I look atrocious um, but yeah uh, we literally spent the first day of class kind of of that class it was um art and social change and yesterday my class was in art and themes and materials which is a studio course but this one is like a studio slash um, lecture course and we are going to be doing projects but they are social um they're like socially centered social centered projects like, as you saw, I think I did take a clip of one of the projects we're going to be doing on a farm. <laughs> um, and we're going to be creating posters and different graphics for it. So I'm really excited. Um, I don't know. As you guys know, I do try to experiment with lots of different mediums, especially at school, because I do take a lot of different courses. Um, but also at home, I do practice a lot of mediums because... I just feel really fulfilled that way, but I do consider myself a painter. But yeah, well, in my in my major in my school, I'm an art media and design major. They they kind of put you they don't put you, but obviously I choose my classes. Um, but there is like a list of classes I need to take that have the credits for me to graduate. Um, and what I like about studying art and being an art major is that you also have to learn art history and different subjects about art um, so it does go really deep which you wouldn't imagine it being once you become an art major I guess it does depend where you go to school and um, what you choose to study in particular but there is so many careers and so many different things you can learn regarding art um, 
but mine's kind of like an overheading of lots of different things. I do a lot of studio, lots of projects, and then I do have like that little sprinkle of history and just anything else to do with art in, in relation to the world and um, socially. So, I don't know. Now, I do have homework I have to finish when I get home, but I am starving. Um, if you guys don't know, I do commute to class. I live in SoCal, so we don't have a lot of public transportation. Everyone drives cars here. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get a snack, go home, probably finish my homework. I don't have that much homework, but I do have to finish watching the film we started in class, um, which is really interesting and kind of depressing, but that's what, not that depressing things are moving, but it kind of just makes you think a lot and taps into your emotion. Good morning everybody. It is 6.56 a.m. and I woke up late actually. I was supposed to wake up at 5.30 and I woke up at 6.15 so I didn't have time to like do my makeup all the way or anything which sucks. But I had a weird morning because someone tried to hack into my um, business account like my business email. Thankfully though Google has so many precautions for that. And right now it's 6.57, so I'm worried I'm going to be late, quite literally, because I still have to park and walk. Um, but I'm sure it's gonna be fine. Damn, I'm gonna be late. <laughs> but I had a weird morning. I had to like deal with some shit. This is why if you are a scammer, literally check your life. Check your life if you are that type of person. I have drawing to today. And I also have experimental media. <laughs> it's so early, guys. I do wake up really early, but I don't like like put on makeup and get out of the house this early. Also, you can't see my face. It's covered by the steering wheel. Uh, it smells like egg in here, and I'm I'm really worried it's my car because they do say that an eggy smell is a sign that something bad has happened to your car. Um, but I'm sure it's outside because it just started. Might be late, which sucks, but hopefully they're understanding because it's the first day. I do park in discount parking because I don't like paying $10 for the whole day. Instead, I like paying $3. up being late by a couple minutes but it's fine because my professor was really nice we're on a break right now and i'm in the studio one of the studio rooms alone
look like a mess. Still out of class. I had a long, long day today. I was in class from 8 a.m. and I just got out of my drawing, my drawing two class, and that lasted from 1 p.m. to 4:20. Usually, I think we're supposed to get at 4:50, but since it's the first day, we got out early, so I had a pretty long day. I'm really tired. I woke up at like. 5.45 a.m. The last class of the week. So I'm taking five courses um, and I go to campus three days a week. And I have four on-campus courses and I try to just schedule them where they're all on um, the same day so I don't have to drive. Um, so yeah, four courses on campus, one asynchronous online. And yeah, I'm excited for this semester. Obviously, I'm going to be filming throughout the semester, doing projects and stuff. Have you guys um, come along with me for that stuff? I always love doing that. 